Hey Safe Moon Army, today we actually have some bad news in the Safe Moon News Today video. So let's go ahead and take a look right here. John has tested positive for COVID, and when he was tested, Jack was with him, so he is self isolating. Please send your best wishes over Twitter, Facebook, or everything, and nothing else. Don't go off about a wallet delay because of this. Please, I could care less. We are a family, we are Safe Moon, which is true. Obviously, best recovery to John and Jack, and we will probably see some wallet delays now that they have COVID, as it will take them roughly a week to get better and get back on their feet to actually producing this content for Save Moon and then working on the Safe Moon wallet. So we are most likely going to be seeing some wallet delays uh, with the release of Safe Moon wallet in the open beta. So guys, don't be mad if we do see those delays. They have COVID. Give them a break, you know what I mean? And if we take a look at some of these, you know, comments, it's all love. Safe Moon Army uh, staying as a Safe Moon family. Get well soon. Safe Moon family will help spread word while you are out of commission. Praise. I pray the mods close this thread. It's because a shit show in her. Have they stated officially that the wallet will be delayed? Unless they are really sick, them being corona positive shouldn't affect the wallet launch at all. John and Jack aren't the ones developing the wallet. I had the same thought. I mean, they aren't doing the technical side of things, which is true. Again, we have some speculation. So, you know, there might not be any wallet delays until they actually say that there are wallet delays. Again, I'm just predicting that they probably will be wallet delays. Now, they aren't working on, you know, the development of the wallet. Wallet. However, uh, you know, they're still working on the back end things, you know, because they are the leaders of SafeMoon and they're still working on financial stuff and other stuff like that. Uh, a part of the wallet that they would actually have to apply for and then the developers are actually working on the wallet itself so the actual development of the wallet itself won't be affected however you know some other back-end stuff could potentially cause delays again uh hopefully we don't see any delays but again if there are delays we have to you know give them our best respect now if we go ahead and take a look over here we have a huge interesting theory on the safe moon official facebook group so let's go ahead and take a look at what raf hurt has to say here are more references to Egypt that I found in two in some previous marketing clips. The first image is a scene of a crew getting ready to cross into a portal to bridge the gap to prosperity. If you have ever seen the movie Stargate, the image should look very familiar. It was about a team of scientists and soldiers who were able to teleport into a parallel universe to a land similar to ancient Egypt. It's a great movie. So basically it is a very similar to a movie cover is what they are trying to say. Um, and it's, you know, pretty much a scene of a crew getting ready to cross into that portal and it says safe moon the bridge to prosperity now if we actually go ahead and take a look right here the second image shows crosshair stopping at hundred percent complete over what is to be present-day Egypt okay with the AMA canceled today and the development team working hard behind the scenes to meet our expectations I think we're in some, for some big news this week so basically saying that this hundred percent is at Egypt so this is huge 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 safe moon Egypt hence nobody knows what this means maybe Egypt is a second country of interest maybe Egypt Egypt is, um, you know, got something to do with the pyramids. We really don't know what is going on with these clues right now. And if you guys do know, please comment down below so I can add it into my next video. But let's go ahead and take a look at some other information that we have coming out today. So right here, what is your guys' answer? Safe Moon Dev puts out the tweet. Question of the day, Safe Moon plus volume equals blank. Say aloud for the people in the back. And obviously that one and only answer, reflections, okay? Reflections, when we trade high volumes, we're getting a percentage of that token um, and that volume being burned and a percentage being reflected to the holders so more and more holders getting money just by holding safe moon absolutely amazing and that is what we like to see we like to see those major reflections speaking of safe moon right over here we can actually see safe moon up for um about eight percent in the past 24 hours for their volume and they're sitting at that 18.8 million dollars in volume mark pretty pretty good compared to what we saw before 17 million 17 million sticking around that 17 million dollar mark however now we are starting to go up absolutely amazing and safe moon actually in it for a four percent price increase over the past day with a market cap of about 1.7 billion guys this is looking very very bullish for safe moon we actually go ahead and take a look at some of these charts right here and see that we are starting to you know continue to grow seeing a massive spike right now again this could be short lasted we could see a dip very very soon but guys we are seeing that nice 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 spike as we speak guys it's looking absolutely amazing just look at that over the past month all up in this downwards trend. However, this spike is one of the greatest spikes that we have seen so far. Now, I want to go ahead and take a look at the spotlight cryptocurrencies on coin market cap. See more. Currently, SafeMoon ranked number three for trend in cryptocurrencies, and obviously, um, CHR is above us. BMON is above us as well. However, SafeMoon sitting at number three. Shiba Inu sitting at number four, and Baby Doge sitting at number five. Now, SafeMoon was actually sitting at number one earlier, which is absolutely amazing. I believe it was around eight hours ago. So that is that is awesome. 
awesome. You know, we love to be seeing that. We want to, you know, continue to grow as a token. And the fact that we are seeing so much wallet information and stuff like that coming out and so much hype behind SafeMoon right now, we're starting to get back on our feet, starting to break out of that downwards trend, which is what we want at the end of the day. We don't want to be in that downwards trend. Again, if we do over time, you know, obviously we might have a month where we're down. However, you know, in like 10 months, are we going to be down? Most likely not. You know, I don't see SafeMoon going farther than what it has gone. Again, that's my personal prediction. That's my personal opinion. I'm not a financial advisor, so you know, you do you, you do what you wish with that information. However, we have this latest tweet that we've already been over, but it says, we will not blink, rest, sleep until the safe moon wallet is in your hands. However, you know, obviously this is just a hint that they will be releasing the wallet very, very soon because, you know, that's just a phrase for saying that, you know, they, they are, it's, it's close to coming, you know, obviously they're going to blink, obviously they're going to rest, obviously they're going to sleep. It's just a phrase that people say when something is very, very close to being done. And I'm sure everybody with common sense knows that, uh, However, you know, that that's very, very good that we will be seeing that safe moon wallet soon. No new hints with the owls, guys. I'm, I'm really confused what these owls are going to be. Um, a lot of people are confused what these owls are going to be. So no new hints with that. However, we just got to wait to see what mysteries it holds potentially. I know there is actually something with Elgato that came out yesterday. Elgato.com, which Elgato is a huge gaming company. Again, safe moons tapped into the gaming niche with their Minecraft server. They released, I believe it was on the 15th, a lot of new stuff. So so if you actually take a look at one of these images, I believe there's like a big owl on, on the Elgato um, website. So if we go ahead and take a look here, there's a big owl on the Elgato website somewhere. Well, they released this Elgato face cam. Now if we actually scroll down on here, again, I highly doubt it correlates. I bet it's just a coincidence, but we could go ahead and scroll down, down to here. We have an owl over in the setup. Now this is why I was confused at first. I'm like, oh, it's just an owl, probably doesn't correlate at all. However, all we see in this setup are the the extensions that you need. We only see Elgato products. So we see a monitor, first of all, a keyboard, a stream deck, a mouse, a light, a light, you know, no decorations at all. But again, there's just a random owl sitting there. So it's like, hold on, guys, what, what are, are they trying to hint something? Like, you know, again, at the end of the day, it's probably just a coincidence, but I just want to go ahead and point that out for anybody that wanted to go ahead and speculate on top of that. Because personally, I think it would be very, very cool to see that Elgato collab. Again, it'd be two major companies and they do have you know sort of the same business motive behind them and at the same time Elgato is partnered with Corsair and some other gaming companies which is absolutely amazing so let me know what you guys thought of this video if you guys did find this video informative then make sure to drop a like on it as well as subscribe to the channel and notifications is turned on we are bringing you daily safe moon update videos okay we're trying to stray away from that clickbait stuff again I've seen a lot of comments about you know clickbait a lot of people mad that I've you know clickbait a little bit in the past however I'm changing up the content I'm not gonna be clickbaiting anymore so thank you so much for continuing to watch it and give me one more chance and I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys later. Peace.